Hey Fox, what's up? So it's time to go ahead and take a step into fireways. So today I have chosen very interesting thing for you guys and it's a really amazing thing to learn how we can integrate fireways, uh, fireways with angular. So integrating firebase with angular requires some kind of packages but I would like to tell you what you, you are gonna to learn in this I will integrate angular with the firebase and use the gmail authentication so the way here I am logged in and my photo is coming from the google that will come up so let's say what you gonna to learn you are having you could have one application where uh, you not need to worry about the authentication you just get authenticated user by gmail or facebook or twitter so all the authentication can be implemented if you know how to integrate gmail authentication with the firebase and angular then you can do other implementation of authentication as well so let's say so the moment i click on the login it will give me the sign in pop up and sign in pop up well <coughs> log in with my account if you haven't logged in in the browser it will ask for the user credentials if you have logged in it will not ask for it so i will show you after logging out as well it uh, it gives us the pop up to <coughs> log in to your gmail account because i have integrated gmail authentication with firebase and it's very very simple in this way i have uh, like uh, done uh, uh, the presentation in a such a way so that you can learn and so it, and there is no presentation i have created ui itself in order to understand so here is my angular firebase home so i will be coming up firebase basics crud operation prime ng firebase facebook authentication firebase gmail authentication today and i have a lot of tutorials angular 5 high charts and all those things so today is time to see how we can do that firebase gmail authentication so first step so i have integrated this very nice step bar as well over here and here is create angular project so in order to clear, create the angular project you need to, to say ng new angular 5 with the firebase so angular 5 with the firebase is my project name then say npm install and i'm using prime ng prime ng save then install animation install font awesome after that add these line in your style sections after that npm install firebase and say next step is go to firebase console log into firebase console with your gmail account go to console click on add project and give the name of the project and click on the create next click on add firebase to your bay app and copy the config settings and paste into your module.ts and next npm install angular fire to save okay so what's uh, what it is telling exactly here in the module.ts here i am having one configuration settings which i am using over here as initialize firebase app config so that's what you will get from there and you just copy these keys and use over here Re import required packages in module.ts the moment you have done with the installations then you need to create the component so you need to create a component which should accept uh, we should uh, have the available things like angular fire 2 you need to import firebase app you need to import in the constructor inject firebase auth and then create login and logout button so i will show you the full code over here let's go to the code first of all this is my module.ts so i have used a, lo a lot of prime ng stuff and uh, here is the things related to the firebase you could do without using prime ng also but in order to make look and feel very nice i have used uh, so this is the combination of angular plus prime ng plus firebase plus gmail authentication so this is the important part which you need to import it over here include that into import sections initialize your config so this is all which we need to do in the module.ts so i am having this uh, app component.html so this is my app component.html where my 
actual part where I am doing login and logout. This is my logout button and this is my login button. If user is already logged in, I not need to log in again. So that's why login button you will be able to see one if user is not logged in. So that's what I have implemented it. So we are checking with the sync pipe path user details we are getting and display name over here. Uh, this is what we are getting and uh, this is my html which uh, really so just you need to just uh, look into this part of the html that that is what it is doing the job okay let's go to the app component.ts so in app component.ts just go and import these things in app component import these things then come down and in the constructor inject your authentication service create two method login and logout so this is uh, how my things are working up and uh, so this is what let's see if we are uh, if um, we want to get something else as well we can uh, get from my login details because uh, if i will go over here and I will say log out me it should log out me the moment I say login it is opening up the pop-up for me and okay which account you would la log in to log in yeah I would like to log in this account my password is already there and when I say please log in okay so it has logged in it has first the image of my account and it has first my gmail account name so that's uh, very nice thing so you could learn you could uh, you could just create the uh, angular project set up the firebase so and create the components and then you just uh, do your uh, login and logout functionality so this is uh, what we have learned in this section if you would like to take uh, follow my step you will be able to implement it if you want the code as well for any videos you just comment on my videos just have a look on the playlist something is a very required thing for you in my playlist you just ask me comment on that video I will provide you the code as well so I would like to thank you for watching these videos and next video I will be coming up with the angular firebase crud operations and uh, prime ng I have already showed you how to use prime ng and uh, here I have showed you prime ng angular 5 with firebase plus gmail authentication next video I can give you the overview how you can integrate facebook authentication as well so you know just see this uh, it's a matter of it's matter of new firebase or dot google auth provider here I can give Facebook auth provider as well which will take so that's uh, uh, very simple this is the key concept how you can implement other uh, uh, other uh, login mechanism as well so just uh, have a look on this code and try to implement it if you have any question comment on my video I will answer all my questions till now my record is I have answered all the questions so Thanks for watching .net. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe it and give me the favor and give me the motivation. Comment on my videos how I can improve it and what uh, questions you have which I can resolve you. Watch on my playlist. Ask for code. I will provide you the code as well. Thanks.